are y'all doing today? Welcome to Angie's Craft Corner. Today we are, I'm just going to do a quick video of reviewing some inks that I have gotten. And now I'm not sure how to pronounce this. It's L-S-U-S Lushan Ink Pads. They came in, this was a 15 pack. And they're pretty good size ink pads. I mean, they ain't many. I'd say there was probably a half an inch by two inches. Hold on. My curiosity is up now. Let me find the real. No, if I could didn't want one, I could find, I could find a thousand of them. Let's see. About two and a half by one and a half. And those fifteen cones in here and those are variety that's what I do like about it <sighs> I mean see the variety you get with this and the good thing of it is it's less than 10 bucks for all of these so yeah I say it's a good deal and they stamp good I've stamped with them I've used the sponges the mini um, sponge I can't I can't really say enough about them I mean I'm gonna take this one off I'm gonna use pumpkin for this and yes ink on from the bottom but look how easy and smooth it is I mean they want just as well as my Stampin' Up! inks I think And you get, uh, you know, something of every color combo. Okay, now, that being said, I'm going to take my perfect plum from Stampin' Up and do the same thing. Let me find me a sponge, though. <coughs> And I got these yesterday too. And uh, so, uh, no. Now I'm starting out with a new sponge on this one. But you can tell. It does just as good, if not better, the cheaper inks.
So y'all see how that works. Try one and I use the Now this one was a new uh, pad. So y'all see the difference kind of Let's try this with the. Oh, those three greens. Okay. We'll use it for that one. I did, I did figure out one thing. You have to kind of get the ink on it. see what I'm saying? I mean, it, they get inks. I just put a little piece of Velcro on the back while I can put my deals here and get ink all over me. <clears throat> okay, now I'm going to take a stamp. This is a butterfly stamp. And I'm going to just stamp a few of them. Well, that could have been the operator. Let's see. I had that same issue with the uh, Stampin' Up, so. But I did stamp a good one. The orange does stamp. I did figure that much out. Now here's one I stamped with that. Um, may not be the same one. Let's try it. See, it stamps just as good as any other ink that you can get. So that's my my thoughts on this ink. And the link will be my the Amazon link will be on uh, my blog at angiecraftcorner.com. And um, give us a thumbs up if you like this video. And we'll catch y'all next time. Thank you for visiting Angie's Craft Corner. And I hope this helps somebody. And like I said, it's just a little review on some, I mean, I got those 15 of them for $9.99. Say 10 bucks. So, and then if you starting out scrapbooking or stamping, you know, and want to invest in some inks, but don't know if you're going to like it. I'd say this is a way to go. So, anyways, I'm going to get off of here. Have a blessed day. I'll catch y'all next time. Have a blessed day.